Hello friends, today we will learn sales order processing in tally. So let's start. So let's understand the transaction. On 5th April received an order. Order number sales ORD T12 from Messer Shoe Planet Home for the following goods which will be dispatched from Mumbai Godons. The order is chair 50 quantity, table 50, rack 40 quantities. To record the above order make yes the following option. Press F11 for company features and then press F2 and go to inventory features. So make yes to highlighted options here. Under the heading general allow zero valued entries yes. Storage and classification maintain multiple go downs to yes. Then third is order processing make sales order processing to yes. And invoicing allow invoicing to yes and allow purchase invoice format to yes. And last is other features use tracking numbers into bracket delivery oblique receipt note to yes and rejection inward outward notes to yes and accept. After that go to inventory vouchers or accounting voucher and press ultra plus F5 for sales order voucher type. For making this entry so create the company open your tally and create company like any name you can give here of the company like we enter here sales order processing we understand the example of sales order that's why I am giving here the name of the company sales order processing and the address here where is your company is located the enter the address select statutory compliances and states here then accounts with inventory and accept it then press F11 for company features so go to inventory features and allow zero valued entries yes sorry sales order processing to yes invoicing to yes and tracking numbers and rejection inward outward notes to yes then press escape key back to gateway of tally go to inventory vouchers press ultra plus f5 for sales order voucher type we see here transaction again like on 5th April received an order from Messer Shoe Planet so create the ledger of parties or daters like Messer Shoe Planet Home under the sundry daters maintain balance bill by bill yes here and accept enter the buyer details here like dispatch to Messer Shoe Planet and address of the buyer like Pune then mode oblique term of payment sales tax number mode oblique term of payment it means how the buyer they give the payment like through bank or check or cash any terms of delivery right here or no dispatch through like via truck tempo ship etc destination where to dispatch like Pune and accept these details then enter the order number here the order is received on 5th April the order number is sales ORD T12 then make a sales ledger put inventory values are affected yes here and then create the item one by one 
first we create your chair under the group furniture the stock group quantity can be added yes and unit is we count here the chairs in quantity the formal name is quantity and symbol is qty except here we don't have any opening stock of chair so we first record here the opening stock we dispatch the goods on 7th april so due due date is 7th april from the mumbai godown and the quantity is here the it will show the negative stock here so that's why we have to enter here the opening stock of chair so press backspace key and control enter and put the quantity here like we enter here 100 under the mumbai godown quantity and the rate will be we put here our purchase rate that is 300 we put here second is table under the furniture group quantity enter press backspace key press again control enter and enter here the quantity of opening stock like we enter here 100 and the rate is 900 same date 7th april dues from mumbai go down the quantity will be 50 which received order from shoe planet then third is a rack under the furniture unit is a quantity again opening stock is 100 and rate is 1800 the order is dispatched from mumbai go down that's why we taking here the mumbai go down write narration received an order from Messer Shoe Planet Home. And I accept it. So we see here the opening stock is here press enter on any item the quantity is showing in under the closing balance of all stock then the order is received actually on 5th april so uh, open your sales order entry and enter the date like 5th april and i accept it Then next transaction is on 7th April. According to the order D12, goods have been transferred from Mumbai Godown and recorded the Chalan number like GDN SPS 15. So press Ultra Plus effort for delivery note. Enter the GDN number, GDN number SP slash S15. You see here the order number is appear here. Enter the dispatch date like 7th April. Only accept the entry like sales order. So deliver the goods from Mumbai go down, write narration here. Before that, you must enter the date here. So press F2 and enter the date 7th April. and accept again write narration like goods deliver delivered from mumbai godown to messrs shiv planet and accept it
after that on 9th april prepare a sales bill against the order number sales ordt 12 with the following rate and additional charges carriage rupees 300 and vat 12.5% on total sales the rate will be 3 150 for chair 1000 for table and rack is 2000 so go to inventory vouchers and press f8 for sales press f2 and enter the date like 9th april enter the sales bill number here like sb slash sp t18 so press enter select the party name select delivery note number here you see here the dispatch date and all details so enter the rate here for chair 350 table is 1000 and rack is 2000 enter for applying the taxes for that press f11 go to statutory tax section and enable value added tax and set oblique alter vat details yes so output vat 12.5% under the duties and taxes type of duty vat select output vat 12.5% and accept the vat is vat ledger is not showing here so press control enter for sales ledger and make use vat return yes and select select tax class 12.5% and accessible calculation yes so tax class will be appear here and select output vat ledger enter and create carriage outward it is an indirect income because we received from the debtors but we taking here indirect expenses for we paid the carriage amount on his behalf so we select here indirect expenses but it's this ledger effect is on credit side of profit and loss so we change uh, after seeing the effect press alter plus f1 for as statutory details yes and write narration prepare a bill or send bill to messer shiv planet home and accept it so press escape go to stock summary you see here the stock is available 50 60 and 50 because we sold some stock so you see here outward is 50 and closing stock is our 100 and the available stock is 50 60 and 50 so press escape go to profit and loss you see here the carriage outward is effect on credit side of the profit and loss because this is our income we received from the debtors but the temporary it's our expenses that's why we getting here we applying to indirect expenses group to it then we see here the closing stock then go to 
display day book you are not seeing here all entries it show only 9th april entries so press ultra plus f2 and enter the date of your financial year and all dates are displayed here so open your sales entry select carriage outward press control enter and change the group under indirect income and accept it press escape key go to profit and loss you see here the effect is same but the under the group in that income so go to display statements of account outstanding receivable you see here the outstanding amount of the data so go to accounting voucher press f6 and receive the full amount from mr dater or shiv planet home the outstanding amount is 166237.50 take the against reference it means the current balance is zero of the dater we received the check of hdfc so create here the bank account hdfc and the bank reconciliation date is approximate 15th april and accept then press escape go to dis sorry go to profit and loss and see here the carriage effect is same here not changing any so go to display day book outstanding receivable you see here not any receivable amount because we received all amount thank you